If you don't wear running sunglasses and you're here to hear why I think you should, then stick around. Hello and welcome. I want to give you my stance on the value of sunglasses for running. I know that there are some pain points when considering glasses and eyewear, just having anything on your face while you're running, talking frame bounds, talking added weight. There are a lot of things that people might not want to buy a pair of dedicated sunglasses for the sport. And I can understand that. I think that there is a lot of value behind having a pair of sunglasses for the sport. And so stick around. I'm gonna give you some of my reasons as to why. And if at the end of this, you are interested in buying, do not forget about Sport RX and definitely don't forget about our See Better Guarantee. Because with that, you're never stuck with something that you don't like or just doesn't work for you. You have as long as 45 days with them. Even if you get them in prescription where you reach out to us, we take care of you no matter what that means on our end. And also we have opticians trained, very knowledgeable, very friendly opticians who would love to help you get it right the first time. So reach out to us. All right, let's talk about why I think you should get running sunglasses. So number one, the very most obvious reason is sun protection. You gotta protect your eyes. If you're going out there without any kind of protection, then you are doing damage, definitely long-term, maybe even short-term damage to your eyes and sunglasses can help considerably. Also, you are gonna be preventing squinting, which could be causing headaches. Essentially, you are potentially taking a distraction away so that you can focus more on your stride. Also, it actually promotes good form. It'll help keep your head up and that's going to relieve stress on your neck and on your shoulders. And also it can be a performance enhancing tool. Well, how? I'm gonna get into that a little bit. I think it's primarily in the lenses, but first let's talk about frames. So what frame features should you look for if you're looking for a good proper pair of running sunglasses? Well, obviously something that is lightweight. You wanna make sure that when you put them on, you can forget about them. I think that's the best thing that you can say about really any eyewear, but especially eyewear that is dedicated to a sport is that you can put them on and you can forget about it. It's just there to help you. It's not there to distract you. With that being the case, obviously you want good coverage. You want it to be that it is protecting your eyes no matter where the sun is and no matter where you turn because you're not gonna just be moving on one straight path. You're running all over the place and it's gonna move the position where the sun is. And so proper coverage is going to protect you no matter what throughout the entire run. Also, you wanna make sure that you have proper and effective grip, ideally on the temples and on the nose bridge. And that may seem to go without saying, but it is something that not all frames out there have, and there are different types of grip. I always recommend going with the hydrophilic type of grip, which is going to be more sweat resistant. There are types out there that are going to actually, as they get wet or as you sweat, grip even better. And those are definitely good features to look for. We always in our frame reviews and our overviews like to point to what frames do have that kind of grip. And so definitely check out the other videos that we have done on that, especially if you want some specific frame recommendations. Right now we're just going over just kind of general overview of what to look for. And that is a big one for sure. All right, well, let's talk about lenses. That is my favorite part for sure. You wanna make sure that you go for something that is more contrast enhancing because that's gonna make it better to read the road, read the terrain. The depth perception cues are going to be enhanced thanks to that boosting color perception and the easier to differentiate between colors. It's gonna make it easier to read what you're looking at. And those depth perception cues are definitely gonna help with understanding what you're looking at for sure. Also, there are options like transitions. What is a transition? It's a photochromic. What is photochromic? It means that it's light reactive. If you are unfamiliar with that, you probably are familiar with it because it's been around for a long time, but it's the pair that you can put on when you're walking inside and they're clear and then you walk outside and they get dark. There are lots of transitions options. There are some that'll work better for the sport than others. You definitely, again, like I said, want to go for something contrast enhancing. If you want a very unique list of lens options, check out SportRx's Sport Optimized lenses. These obviously are available for prescription users and prescription wearers, but we can still actually make them in non-prescription. If you don't need prescription, that is definitely still a really cool and unique option that you can look at, or options rather, because we have multiple different options, uh, but they are lenses that are more designed to work specifically for the sport and be transitioned. So it'll give you that variable 
uh, functionality, which means that you could run early in the morning before the sun's all the way up, and then as the sun gets all the way up, you don't need to swap your glasses out. So it gives you a little more versatility, whether the light changes while you're running or you just wanna have a more all around pair. Also, while we're talking about versatility, and prescription, if you need progressives, this is something that we really base on the user, what you need most. I think that progressives aren't really, they can think they're kind of more neutral. They're not really beneficial, but they also aren't a hindrance. Uh, there's not much of use that you're gonna get out of having progressives in your running pair unless you typically look at something up close while you're running but I think that most people tend to not, but it does make them a more versatile because it means that you can still wear them as an everyday pair. You can still wear them when you're driving and that'll allow you to see your dashboard. You can still wear them when you're out and about and you can see something up close like your cell phone or whatever it is that you wanna look at that's closer than 20 feet out in the distance. And so consider progressives. If you do need those, it definitely can be something that works for the sport. Uh, there are other sports that I don't recommend it for, but in this case, it's more of a neutral. So that wraps up my top tips from Tyler. I hope that this was helpful. I went pretty broad strokes for sure. Uh, I didn't get too deep into the weeds because this was more of a broad overview. If you feel like I missed something you still want some clarification on, definitely leave comments in the comment section below because we'd love to hear from you and we'll get back to you. Also, don't forget about that See Better guarantee because I really do think that it gives you a ton of peace of mind, especially when you're ordering online. And for even more peace of mind, like I mentioned, our opticians would love to help you get it right. Reach out to us. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope this was interesting or valuable information, exactly what you're looking for. Please give us a like if so, because that helps us. You can find relevant videos over here. And also we have great content on our social media outlets. And I think you should check it out because I think you'd like it. And you can find us at SportRx. Thank you.